Hello everyone, welcome to my channel uh, C Sharp and uh, today I am going to show you how to use type builder and actually to create a type at runtime. So in this video tutorial I am just going about type builder and the type builder is actually create a type at runtime and you can say that it's inherent from the uh, super class or you can say that the base class and uh, define one, uh, one constructor and in each of this uh, define in the super class okay so i don't uh, need the constructor to actually do but uh, there is an argument of the parent class it's just like a pass through constructor so uh, this is the example of the pass through constructor and you can uh, just create a type uh, at runtime so here we have a uh, extension method of the type builder helper class uh, that is the helper uh, that that is the extension method of the type builder class that is create pass through constructor so here we have a pass through constructor with the type builder class and the type is the base class so you if you want to use this uh, class so just define the type of the constructor so here we have a constructors and uh, just base type dot get constructors so define the base uh, that is getting from the old constructor and by using the single constructor you just get the parameter of the constructor by using this line constructor dot get parameters and uh, the parameters dot length if it is the parameters dot length is greater than zero and the parameters dot last uh, dot is defined type of parameter array attribute is the false then continue okay the process is continue and uh, like that the parameter types is parameters dot select p dot parameter types dot array so define the uh, that is the type of the parameters and here by using the required custom modifiers you just uh, get the type of array that is the two dimensional array by using the parameters dot select get required custom modifiers dot to array and by using the optional custom modifier if you want to get so you just get the two dimensional array of the type uh, class and uh, by using this you can just got uh, that uh, in the in the constructor uh, that is the constructor builder of your base class so builder dot define constructor method attribute dot public constructor dot calling conventions and parameter type required custom modifiers and optional custom modifiers so here we have uh, the four loops to iterate the parameter in the parameter builder class this is the super uh, example to create a type uh, builder you can say at runtime. So here we have a for loop with mm, just going for the parameters dot length. Here we have a parameter and the parameters of i parameters builder and uh, that is the constructor that is created and the defined parameters that the length is i plus one parameters attribute parameters dot name and is the type of if you if it is just check the parameters that attribute uh, and integer dot parameters dot attributes dot has default is not equal to zero so parameters builder dot select uh, set content uh, constant that is parameter dot raw default so similarly like that for each loop and for the attribute building uh, build custom attributes and for each loop just after iterating this process so here we have a attribute in build custom attributes and that is the emitter for uh, constructor get i uh, mm, IL generator that is the intermediate language uh, generator so emitter dot emit op codes that is knob and emitter dot emit op code dot uh, L drag underscore zero so here we have a for loop for the parameters length and last one is the emitter dot emit and the next one is if you want to get the custom attribute builder so you can use that uh, method of array that written uh, array of custom attribute builder so this line of code will be uh, helping to create a custom uh, type builder at runtime. So here we have a code and this is the uh, valuable code and uh, just get the code uh, in C-sharp to generate a type at runtime. So this is the static method and uh, this is the extension method you have to add in your C-sharp project to generate a type um, uh, at runtime. Uh, run so thank you very much for watching this video.